in my belly when I was in the sausage. So she's been part of it, haven't you, mate? Violet arrived just over a fortnight ago and is, of course, blissfully unaware of her mother's triumph at the weekend in The Masked Singer. When the night falls, my lonely heart comes. Filmed last September, one of the first British series since the start of the pandemic to be shot with a studio audience, Joss Stone, dressed as a sausage, was declared the winner of a show in which celebrities sing hidden behind elaborate costumes. Stone's fellow finalists were a badger and a robin, while a panel tries to guess who they are. An average audience of more than eight and a half million watched at the weekend, with the winner admitting it was tougher than she'd expected. The suit kind of doesn't allow a lot of breathing going on. But when you've got a little baby in you, I think it pushes stuff around. And then your lungs are like half of what they used to be. It was very odd. Huge numbers watched the final. Why do you think that is? It's not serious. I think we I think we've had enough of all the seriousness. They call me hell. They call me Stacy. It's bright, it's colourful, it's fun. It's just all positive. There's nothing negative about it. Whereas you know, you've got other singing shows, music shows, where you see people burst into tears, you know. It breaks their whole heart when they get voted off. Let's come to the Grammy and Brit Award-winning singer has been recording new material during lockdown, but like many musicians, concert dates have been pushed back. Whatever happens, she says, her priorities have changed. I'm going to base all my decisions on, like, a happiness scale. And if it's over five, I'll do it. And if it ain't, I'm not going to do it. So that's why I make decisions like going on The Masked Singer. <laughs> now I just want to be a good mum, take her to school and pick her up from school. She's awesome. Everything that she does is funny to me. When she sees this, Violet may well say the same about her mum. Nina Nana, News at 10.